Thank you for coming to Green Hill Park for the dedication of the Do Goods Lane Bridge in memory of Air Crewman Rescue Swimmer James P. Buriak. Today we gather not just to dedicate a bridge, but to honor a man who recognized the value of serving and protecting others. Tragically, Jimmy died when his helicopter went down off the coast of San Diego, California on August 31, 2021. This bridge will stand as a testament to the sacrifice and dedication of Jimmy, who served our nation with unwavering commitment. For a whole entire family, having a bridge dedicated and named after Jimmy is such a huge thing. Um, we're extremely grateful to have a spot that people can drive over and read his name and then look up his story. And so Jimmy was um, a Salem native, uh, graduated high school, went to college here. Um, we came back to the town always and it was just such an important part of who he was and who our family is. Our roots are here and so um, having it here at the park is just, uh, it's a place he grew up and it's, it's amazing to be able to be here today and to have all of the people here and honor and memory of him. Well, I think there's very few things we can do that are more meaningful as elected officials than to honor, especially our fallen military. And this situation fit that bill. And so it was something that we could do at the state level with uh, recognitions and resolutions, but also at the local level, we wanted to make sure there was a lasting remembrance for Jimmy Buriak for not only this generation, but future generations. And it's gonna be wonderful that as so many Roanoke Valley children ride over this bridge and read what this sign says, their parents will be able to tell them who Jimmy was. And they'll be able to tell them that Jimmy was someone who grew up here, who was a proud uh, local person, and who served our country. Well, I want people to feel energized by, uh, by seeing the sign. I want them to know there's somebody out there. There's always somebody out there that is working hard for his fellow man. Jimmy was definitely the epitome of service for others. And so I think it's very fitting that we remember him and we remind ourselves over and over again of his sacrifice and what he did accomplish. He would not be happy. Uh, Jimmy was so humble and um, just gracious that he didn't have a exuberant bone in his body, but I think he would be grateful. I think he would be honored. And I think that um, having his memory live on forever is just something that our family has tried so hard to continue to do through, through these days over the last three years.